here at that time, Hogan was passing the torch to Rock pretty much in 2002, right? Mm-hmm. Rock hadn't been in the business that many years. And then Rock takes the torch and takes it to Hollywood. It <laughs> <laughs> make, yeah. makes real yeah. money with the torch. Yeah. Yeah. You, to Hollywood. you just got the torch. You know? <laughs> One of the legends. And, but, yeah. um, and that's what. That guy, he owns everything now. I know. He owns, I, well, you know what we need to do, Jerry? We need to forget about billionaire Connie and go to the, go with the rock. It's only what we the billionaire, do. billionaire Dewey. That, yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> but well, Mike, hey, Mike, I mean, go ahead, Don. I was going to ask you a, a very serious question. Yeah. Uh, Tony Chimmel. Uh, yes. I always uh, thought hiring Chimmel was like losing five good men. <laughs> he, was, he was he was he was awful not a few good men but five good men huh, <laughs> that's right was he how was he on the ring crew <laughs> he was great man you know i love tony and if, if it wasn't for tony chimble teach you know he's he's a good um four years older than me so at the time when i'm starting him with him in the ring crew at 18 19 you know he's 22 23 he taught me a lot john on the ropes you know and um, he taught me a lot and we went through a lot. We lived, you know, we basically, we didn't get our own rooms because we were like, we, we, got a, we, we got a room together because we drove in the trucks together. We roomed together. We played cards to late night in the room. You know, after we get in, we drank at the hotel together. We did everything together. You know, we were like brothers. And, um, you know, I depended on him. He depended on me. You know, when we used to have to drive thousands and thousands, I mean, we put God knows how many, a couple million miles on these trucks yeah. and um, all the driving that we've done and in the flying in between and and uh, renting trucks in certain places, international like Canada or other places. But um, he taught me so much, man, John, he really did. You know, I know, I know he's, he's a little difficult, hard. A little, a, l- a, a little, little. A little. Tony hey, I'm still trying to get him on my podcast. The, I don't want to bury him too bad yet. The, 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 ours. He agreed to it and then canceled. Uh, yeah. I know. Well, yeah. So we, we yeah. got canceled by Tony Chimmel. That's like the worst <laughs> cancellation you could have. Yeah. I can see John, if the rock if the rock John, cancels, don't, cool. <laughs> don't ever don't don't advertise that. Don't talk about it. It makes us look bad. I mean, Tony Chimmel culture or something. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but Chim Chimmel was afraid we'd throw him under a bus. I mean, uh, you know, there's so many opportunities to throw that guy under a bus, but the right. bus would the bus would tip over when it when it ran <laughs> over that big road ton body. You know? <laughs> we don't want to injure the passenger, so we're not going to throw anybody under. A bus. Yeah, right. So, 